The Great Flood, A New Beginning, written by Morgan Freeman through the wormhole. The story of Noah's Ark is one of the most enduring tales in human history. Imagine a world engulfed in water, a deluge of biblical proportions washing away the sins of humankind. This was the scene after God, angered by the wickedness of humanity, sent a flood to cleanse the earth. Only Noah, a righteous man, found favor in God's eyes. Noah was commanded to build an ark, a massive vessel designed to weather the storm and preserve life. He gathered his family and two of every animal species, seeking refuge within the ark's wooden embrace. For 40 days and 40 nights, the rains fell, reshaping the planet and leaving only the ark afloat. As the waters receded, the ark came to rest on the mountains of Ararat, a beacon of hope amidst a desolate landscape. Noah, his family and the animals disembarked, stepping onto a world reborn. They were tasked with repopulating the earth, a monumental responsibility that rested on their shoulders. With the world washed clean, Noah received a covenant from God, a promise symbolized by the rainbow. It was a pledge that never again would the world be destroyed by a flood. This marked a new beginning for humanity, a chance to rebuild and create a world anew. Noah's sons, architects of a new world. Noah and his wife had three sons, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. These three men, along with their wives, would become the progenitors of the human race after the flood, a monumental task that would shape the course of human history. These three men, along with their wives, would become the progenitors of the human race after the flood. They were tasked with the immense responsibility of repopulating the earth and establishing new societies. Each son, according to biblical and historical accounts, would go on to father a line of descendants that spread across the globe, establishing settlements and cultures that shaped the ancient world. Their journeys and the civilizations they founded are a testament to human resilience and ingenuity. Shem, the eldest, is traditionally considered the ancestor of the Semitic people. His lineage would give rise to some of the most influential civilizations in the Near East. This lineage would give rise to civilizations in the Near East, including the Akkadians, the Babylonians, the Assyrians, and ultimately, the Israelites. These civilizations contributed significantly to the development of writing, law, and urbanization. From them came the Hebrew Bible, a cornerstone of Western religion and thought. The texts and teachings from this lineage have had a profound impact on religious and philosophical traditions worldwide. Ham, the second son, is said to have fathered the nations that settled in Africa, parts of the Middle East, and possibly even parts of Asia. His descendants are associated with the ancient Egyptians, Ethiopians, Canaanites, and others. His descendants are associated with the ancient Egyptians, Ethiopians, Canaanites, and others. These cultures are renowned for their monumental architecture, such as the pyramids, and their advancements in various fields, including mathematics, medicine, and astronomy. Their contributions to art, architecture, and governance are undeniable. The legacies of these civilizations continue to influence modern society in numerous ways. Japheth, the youngest, is linked to the Indo-European peoples, a vast group that migrated across Europe and parts of Asia. This branch includes the Greeks, Romans, Persians, and many others who shaped classical civilizations. This branch includes the Greeks, Romans, Persians, and many others who shaped classical civilizations. Their contributions to philosophy, science, and the arts laid the foundations for much of Western culture. Their influence on language, philosophy, law, and government resonates to this day. The ideas and systems developed by these civilizations continue to underpin modern legal and political structures. The story of Noah's sons is a tale of migration, adaptation, and the rise of diverse cultures. It is a narrative that underscores the interconnectedness of human history and the shared heritage of all people. It highlights how a single family, in the wake of a catastrophic event, could give rise to the vast tapestry of humanity. Their legacy is a reminder of the enduring spirit of human innovation and the unbreakable bonds that connect us all. Shem's lineage cradling civilization, Shem's descendants, the Semites, played a pivotal role in the development of some of the world's earliest civilizations. These early Semitic people were instrumental in laying the foundations of human society as we know it. They primarily settled in the Fertile Crescent, 
a region in the Middle East known for its fertile land and the birth of agriculture. This area, often referred to as the Cradle of Civilization, was where humans first began to transition from nomadic lifestyles to settled agricultural communities. This area, nourished by the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, provided an ideal environment for societies to flourish. The rivers not only supplied water, but also facilitated trade and communication, which were crucial for the growth of these early civilizations. Among Shem's most prominent descendants were the Akkadians, who established the first known empire in Mesopotamia around 2300 BCE. The Akkadian Empire was a significant milestone in human history, marking the beginning of imperial rule and centralized governance. Their innovations in language, writing and governance laid the foundation for future Mesopotamian cultures. The development of cuneiform writing allowed for the recording of laws, trade transactions and historical events, which was a revolutionary step in human communication. The Babylonians, who rose to prominence later, inherited this legacy, expanding their empire and further developing law, mathematics and astronomy. The Code of Hammurabi, one of the earliest and most complete written legal codes, is a testament to their advanced legal system. Another significant branch of Shem's lineage gave rise to the Assyrians known for their military prowess and vast empire. The Assyrians were not only fierce warriors, but also skilled administrators who managed a vast and diverse empire. They controlled trade routes, developed sophisticated military strategies and established a complex administrative system. Their ability to maintain control over such a large territory was due in part to their innovative use of communication and logistics. Their influence stretched across the ancient Near East, impacting various cultures and societies. The Assyrian Empire's reach extended from the Mediterranean Sea to the Persian Gulf, making it one of the largest empires of its time. Perhaps the most impactful group descended from Shem were the Israelites. Their unique cultural and religious practices set them apart from other ancient civilizations. Led by Abraham, who journeyed from the city of Ur, they established a distinct cultural and religious identity. This journey was not just a physical migration, but also a spiritual quest that would shape the future of monotheistic religions. The Israelites' covenant with God, their laws and their prophets would profoundly influence Christianity and Islam, shaping the moral and spiritual landscape of the world. Their religious texts, including the Torah, have been foundational to Western religious thought. The story of Shem's descendants is a testament to the power of innovation, adaptation and cultural transmission. Their ability to adapt to changing environments and circumstances allowed them to thrive and influence future generations. Their contributions to language, law, governance and religion laid the groundwork for many of the values and institutions that shape our world today. The legacy of Shem's descendants is a rich tapestry of human achievement and cultural evolution. The Journey West Japheth's descendants. While Shem's lineage flourished in the Near East, Japheth's descendants embarked on a westward migration spreading across Europe and parts of Asia. This migration was not a single event, but a series of movements over generations driven by the search for new lands and opportunities. These Indo-European peoples, linked by language and shared cultural roots, established settlements that would become the foundation of classical civilization. Their influence can be traced through the development of various ancient societies, each contributing uniquely to the tapestry of human history. The Greeks, renowned for their philosophy, democracy, art and literature, established city-states that became centers of learning and cultural exchange. Athens in particular became a beacon of intellectual and artistic achievement, influencing countless generations. Their ideas about reason, logic and the pursuit of knowledge had a profound impact on Western thought. The works of philosophers like Socrates, Plato and Aristotle laid the groundwork for modern science, politics and ethics. The Romans, known for their military might, engineering prowess and legal system, built a vast empire that stretched across Europe, North Africa and the Middle East. Their ability to integrate diverse cultures under a unified system was key to their long-lasting influence. Their legal principles and administrative structures influenced the development of law and governance in many parts of the world. The Roman concept of citizenship and their codified laws have left an enduring legacy.
Further east, the Persians established a powerful empire known for its tolerance, administrative efficiency, and cultural achievements. The Achaemenid Empire, under leaders like Cyrus the Great and Darius, became a model of effective governance. Their intricate system of roads and communication facilitated trade and cultural exchange between east and west. The Royal Road, for instance, allowed for rapid movement of goods and information across vast distances. Their artistic traditions, influenced by both eastern and western motifs, produced stunning works of art and architecture. The grandeur of Persepolis and the detailed craftsmanship of Persian artefacts continue to be admired. The Celts, another branch of the Indo-European family, spread across Europe, leaving their mark on art, language and mythology. Their society was organized into tribes, each with its own customs and traditions. Their intricate metalwork, vibrant storytelling traditions and spiritual beliefs continue to fascinate and inspire. The legends of heroes and gods passed down through generations reflect the rich cultural heritage of the Celts. The westward migration of Japheth's descendants demonstrates the human capacity for exploration, adaptation and cultural diffusion. This movement was marked by encounters with diverse environments and peoples, each interaction adding to the complexity of human civilization. Their interactions with different environments and peoples led to the emergence of distinct cultures, languages and traditions that continue to shape the world today. The legacy of Jephthah's descendants is a testament to the enduring spirit of human curiosity and resilience. Ham's Legacy, a tapestry of cultures. Ham's descendants, according to tradition, journeyed south and east, settling in Africa, parts of the Middle East and possibly parts of Asia. This vast diaspora gave rise to a rich tapestry of cultures, each with its own unique contributions to human history. The ancient Egyptians, renowned for their magnificent pyramids, hieroglyphic writing and sophisticated understanding of mathematics and astronomy, flourished along the Nile River. Their contributions to art, architecture and religious beliefs continue to captivate and inspire. The Ethiopians, with their long and storied history, developed a unique culture known for its distinctive art, architecture and ancient Christian traditions. The Canaanites, who inhabited the Levant, played a significant role in the development of early alphabetic writing, which spread throughout the Mediterranean region, laying the foundation for many modern writing systems. Their cities, such as Tyre and Sidon, were important centers of trade and commerce, connecting the ancient Near East with the wider world. While the exact geographical distribution of Ham's descendants is a subject of debate, their impact on human history is undeniable. Their contributions to art, architecture, language, religion and trade highlight the diversity and ingenuity of the human spirit.